Hey everyone. I see that there's a couple people already here. How's everybody doing today that's here? All right, we'll wait a couple minutes for a few more people to join um, before I get into it. But today I am going to be showing you how to shop the Globe on add-ins and um, choose your theme for the month. And then also in this big box here, I have my VIP sale items. Um, I didn't get them in time to do my regular Globe in video with them. So that's why I will open them in this video here. Um, so I'll give it a couple more seconds, but just want to see how's everybody doing. This is my first live stream. I am extremely nervous. <laughs> I'm an introvert, so this is very, very different for me, and I'm going to be treating myself to probably like Burger King and Target after this because, um, hey everybody. Okay, cool. So behind me, this is a very weird setup, but behind me, I do have my laptop. I have my sister's laptop right here so I can read comments a little bit better. Um, but behind me, I have my laptop and the Globe In website open. I've already gone through and looked at some of the add-ons and put some in my cart. I am an annual subscriber, which is why I'm able to access these today. If you are just a month to month subscriber, they'll be open for you tomorrow. So stay tuned for that and you'll be able to see some of the options that are available and what has already been sold out. So let me go ahead and look behind me. So I'll click back on monthly themes. So every month there is a theme that you can choose from. I think this month is called Sizzle and that's what I selected. Um, and so it will automatically default to a surprise box if you don't go in and change it. So that, like I said, I chose this month's theme. Um, and if I hit choose a different box, it gives me the different options that I have. So I can select the surprise theme again. You can redeem the amount of money that you want to use. And then bathe, slurp, and buzzed are the other boxes that you could choose from, which are some of the past boxes. I hope you can see what's on the screen, but I don't really know how to show it better. <laughs> Um, so I, like I said, I chose the theme. I like to try to choose the theme for the month just because I want to see different items, but again, you can redeem. And because of you guys signing up with my link, you, I do get credit from that. So I have a lot of add-on credits if you see that here. So thank you everybody who has subscribed to my link. Um, and I see some of my favorite people commenting on here. So hello. Um, so let's go to the add-ons. Like I said, I've kind of shopped through them. Um, these earrings, which... I don't know if you can really see, I got in the add-ons for June. So really love them. They're really dangly, which I'm not used to. Fun fact, um, I got a couple other pairs of earrings last month in my add-ons and um, <laughs> the first day I wore them to work, which was Friday, um, I was walking around and I went to go touch my ear and one of them was missing and I never found the earring. I still have not found the earring. I don't know where it is. I called Lost and Found at work. It's gone, so hopefully I'll be able to find it eventually, but as of now, it's lost, so I only have one of them. But let's go ahead and look at the add-ons. So every month they have an artisan fund, and their goal this month is 1,860, so you can donate your money or your um, credit towards that. So it is for um, the artisan fund. What is it this month? Um, so this is for the Oaxacan baskets, which is in Mexico. So it tells you a little bit about the fund for this month. Um, so let's scroll down a little bit more so you can donate 20, 10, or five for that. And then you can also choose past artisan boxes, um, on here as well. So you can choose a sizzle box. So you could pick more than one if you wanted to have an additional box, if you love it that much or want to gift it. And then there's a hydrate box. If you click on them, it'll tell you. So let me just like click on the sizzle box as it loads. Okay, so it tells you all of the things that are in it, the price, and then you can skip through some of like the different pictures that it has of the items. I definitely do that for some of the items just to see like how big they are. Sometimes it's hard to tell some of the add-on items are and I've definitely bought stuff before thinking it's gonna be bigger or smaller than it is so the pictures usually really help with that um, you can pick the hydrate box the delish box which was the one that had the ice cream cups and scoops um, thanks Evans. I love my hair too <laughs> I was very nervous to cut it short um, and then with the delish box you get those beautiful um, hand-blown like glasses and I already broke one so that's fun. Um, I was washing the dishes and I had it like on the side, like upside down to dry and I knocked it over and the bottom broke off and I was very sad, but I still have one. So that's good. 
So then there's also a tea party box, a bathe box. It looks like the buzz box and epicure box are already sold out. Um, but if you keep staying tuned, they may come back into stock. I know personally, I go in and um, like go, I just lost my train of thought. I go in and I add a bunch of add-ons and then I remove and edit my cart a little bit later in the month. So you may see items pop back up because I'm sure some other people do that. So they break it out by theme every month and there's different themes that you can go into and shop from. So one of them is the fire up the grill and hear that sizzle. So that's kind of based on the theme of the month. So they have the bread basket, bamboo tent and Moroccan meze plate, which I think all come in the actual theme for this month. And then they have a lot of fun kitchen items this month, which are my favorites. Um, so they have a patchwork apron. They have a bunch of recipe stands. I got, I've gotten the cars carved rosewood re recipe stand. I use that to place a holy book on. Um, but you can, which is I think traditionally actually how a lot of those are used. But you can put whatever you want on them. Um, stainless steel spreaders. So they have a bunch of aprons and oven mitts. I'm really picky about my oven mitts, so I'm probably not going to get them because I had an oven mitt one time perfectly normal oven mitt and I completely burned my finger on it um, for whatever reason so I have these really heavy duty fancy ones because I don't want to burn myself again. Um, then they have some wooden spoons. So this is the first item I picked. It is the round spoon. Um, I haven't gotten a lot of their... Um, you can start doing the add-ons tomorrow, Abby. Um, if you're a 6 or 12 month subscriber, I think 6 as well, you have access to them today um, but tomorrow you'll be able to get them or technically midnight, I think. So if you really want to stay up late, you have that option as well. Um, so I picked this round spoon um, and it helps to mix and stir your sauces, puddings, anything, whatever. They give a description. So I got that because I thought it was really pretty. And I, like I said, I, hadn't, I haven't gotten a lot of their like wood items yet. So wanted to try that out. They have some cute like just bottom half aprons, which are fun. I have so many aprons, so that's why I'm not getting one. Um, more oven mitts, lots of different colors, some like cutting boards they have as well. And then I got this ceramic colander, which is blue and white. It's really, really pretty. And they, they display it with berries. It comes from Nepal and it is dishwasher safe, which let's be real, that is a blessing. Um, and so it, it shows them with berries, which I think is a really great um, idea because a lot of times, like I just put them in my like in like a pasta strainer and then put that in the fridge and that like takes up half the fridge. So I think that this will be cute and it's a pretty piece that you can take out if people are over or you want a cute look when you're eating your breakfast, which I don't really care about. It's too early to worry about that kind of stuff. I get up at 5.30 for work, so um, I'm not really worried about that at 5.30 in the morning, but anyway. So then there's some more wooden items. They also have some seasonings, which are fun. I've gotten them some before and they were really good when I tried them. Um, more wood stuff, a mortar and pestle. They have glass bowls and a lot of their ceramics. I think I already have some of these bowls here. They have a lot of different options with their ceramics. I love them. And then some tea towels and a, I really want this cash cat dish carrier, but I think my sister might kill me if I get that. So I'm not going to do that for now, <laughs> maybe in the future. Um, then they move into the next theme is summer alfresco tablescapes great entertaining or casual everyday dining so um and yes it does feel weird doing a live i'm like filming it like it's a video which i'm trying to interact it's just it's hard to to also be like looking at this screen and um like go through that and try to catch everybody's comments so if i'm missing your comment i apologize this is just so new to me um so they have a lot of table runners and placemats bowls. I definitely am going to be getting some of those. So they have some spice trays and then there's a set of these three oval baskets that I'm picking up. Um, I've just been really into like natural, natural items in general, but um, natural baskets, like woven materials. I, <laughs> the reason why I've been filming, so this is going to be my new filming space, but I could also film in my living room, which is where my Jalsa or that couch is from my old video. Um, the reality is, <laughs> There have been boxes all in that room all week and I've had this apartment two weeks now. I just, I haven't gotten to them and today I did a really good job. I've cleaned up a lot of it. There's still a couple left. So until I get that cleaned up, you won't be seeing that space, but there's lots of baskets in there right now and I need them to find some homes. So <laughs> they're exactly where they're going to be, but I'll figure that out eventually. Um, so anyway, getting these three baskets, not totally sure what I'll use them for yet. I have on my makeup table and I'll be doing an apartment tour um once it's organized um i do have a makeup table now which i didn't really have before and so i'm using some of the baskets to put things like my brushes in there's also they have some really beautiful woven baskets this pink one 
when it loads I have like on my dressers I have a couple pink like ceramics and other things not all from Globin but I thought that this pink little basket would be cute to put some of like my jewelry or hairbands or things that I don't really need out in the open to be seen in there because um, I have a lot of stuff and I need to get rid of clutter <laughs> um a lot of more woven things they have these bread and tortilla baskets which are totally like interesting to me but the patterns don't really speak to me personally but I think they're cool so um a lot more woven baskets and placemats there's another one of the baskets like I'm getting but that's in pink this teak wood board is so cool to me but it has a hole in the middle and I'm not really sure like why or what it's supposed to be used for so let me know because <laughs> I think it's like so cool but I'm like I have no idea how I would use that so I'm gonna order it and it's just gonna sit there and I don't really want that either then this was so cute. This is an olive wood honey pot and it has like the little honey dripper. I don't even know if I'm gonna use it for honey. I just think that it is so cute and I just, I need it in my life and so I'm gonna get it. Um, so that's another add-on you can get. And then they get into some of the more of the ceramics. I do have the um, Tabarka platter, which I, when I cook Middle Eastern food, like a Kepsa or whatever, I like to put it on that to display it. But they have some other platters and dishes as well. I love their ceramics. I particularly love the ones that you can dishwash. Not all of them you can. There's different companies. Some of them you can dishwash, other ones you cannot. I like the dishwash kind. Not that you can't wash it by hand in that scenario. So I got these baskets, but they have them again in like a blue greenish color. So that's the awesome thing too, is you can get a lot of stuff in different colors more of the ceramics, more really cool wooden spoons, but I'm just going to do one and see um, if I use it. So um, yes, I do find the products, uh, the quality of the products really good. Now, obviously there's different artisans. Um, so it just kind of depends on where you get it from. But I found that, I mean, these are handmade items. They tend to be a little bit better. Sometimes they are more finicky and you have to be a little bit more careful with them because of that, or they'll be very specific with, with their washing instructions. They have some like glass mugs where you can't put hot liquid in. And if you do, the bottom of the glass will like come apart. So there's some more finicky pieces of just like the upkeep, keep, uh, blah, 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 can't talk, and care of the items. But um, most of, most of the stuff is really good quality. Better than like if you're gonna go to home goods. Like obviously this is gonna be more expensive than if you go to like a home goods or a Target. Um, Cause I, I have been really bad with home goods recently since I moved cause it's just exciting to buy stuff. Um, but I found that the quality is really, really good. So then they have a lot of really cool patterned baskets. Um, yes, they, they, I keep talking directly to Georgia Sunshine but I never said your name. Hi, I love you. <laughs> um, Okay, I'm back. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened right there. My internet went out and in, so I'm not really sure what happened because the internet was working fine on both of my laptops. So I guess my phone just doesn't like me. I did just upgrade my phone, so my, maybe that's why. So this basket was just so cool. It has like these like weird designs around it, and I just, I'm really excited about it. It'll probably go next to my Jalsa because it's like a similar like orangey natural colors and red colors. So it's probably where it will end up, but who knows because I still have to reorganize my whole apartment. There's also a really cool table runner. I'm not actually going to use it on a table. I'm going to probably use it on like a side table. So we'll see where that ends up. I also have a really cool bookcase at work that I could kind of put it over if I wanted to as well. So I passed this up one time on add-ons and I regretted it and I really wanted it. So um, getting it now while I still can. A lot more of their olive wood um, products which are just so pretty. I just need to be careful because I have so much stuff. I don't need a million things, but it's really easy to do that here. Some more of the platters. They have an olive picker. And I thought that I was like, oh, that exists. I mean, I don't eat olives that much, but <laughs> it's cool. I mean, if you like olives, I think that's a really awesome thing to get. Um, olive bowls. They have like a whole like olive, olive wood and actual olive section. So that's cool. And then they go on to keeping it cool summer refreshments. So this is where they have some more of their glass items. Um, like some of the glasses. I do have the stemless wine glasses, the colorful ones. I got them for upgrading to the annual subscription. I don't drink alcohol, but it's a cup so you can drink wine and all of that fun stuff out of it. And they do have a lot of wine coasters, which I, are either for wine glasses or wine bottles, but they have a lot of those options as well as some pitchers, margarita glasses, and pitchers. I have that pitcher as well, which I think I got when I upgraded. A lot of things for like, they have some coasters, so um, that's awesome. So the box is $40 every month plus 
um, $10 shipping, so $50 altogether. But if you sign up for a six or 12 month subscription, it does come down. So for me, I think it's like 43 instead of 50 because I'm an annual subscriber. If you go to one of my like unboxing videos of it, I do have $30 off coupon if you're interested in um, signing up. So you can do that as well. Some really cool wine holders. Uh, this There's a little basket where you can put little drinks in, which is really awesome. But I just got one of those little holders in the decorated box. So I don't really need one now. I was interested in one at the time. Then Taste of Home. So there's some really cool stuff in this section. So uh, you have more of the wall hanging baskets. They have a crocheted cotton hammock. There's only one left. And it's really, really awesome. And I really want it, but I have literally no stuff so I'm not gonna get it um they also have a crochet hair but I just think it's really cool like I've never seen anything like that on the add-ons before then they have some baskets um some of the nesting the sorry handled nas nesting excuse me baskets and the chindi handle baskets which are really cool like a set of three I got a set of three but of the bread baskets which we're getting again this month and really like them they also have their lanterns, so there's some really pretty lanterns. These ones are blue, and they have them in lots of different colors. I really want to get some, but the colors that they have don't exactly go with my decor right now, so I don't know if they're going to have more colors in the future. Some wind chimes. I do have one of the wind chimes. I, in my old apartment, I had a perfect space. I don't know where I'm going to put it in the new apartment yet. Some pink ones. Some more of the things. And they, have, they have a light pink and a dark pink some little hanging garlands. They have cats, elephants, and turtles, which is really fun. And actually, I think I may have some in the VIP items when we get to that. Some green lanterns, some of their, sorry, wall hangings, and then purple lanterns as well. I feel like if you have a little girl, like the purple and pink lanterns would be so cute for the bedrooms. Me planning for kids that I don't have already, <laughs> or don't have yet, excuse me. Um, some more bells and chimes. And then they have this take it outside category which is fun so they have some outdoor games for outdoor games here at this apartment so okay now it's back my internet just hates me so um I got a wi-fi extender because this is in a different part of my house but we do have a thunderstorm going on right now which is probably why this keeps disconnecting um but anyway we also have some phone phone holders and some tins as well as glasses cases and backpacks which are really cool um I really apologize about my wi-fi <laughs> I'm not used to going live and I guess it doesn't like me. They also have these really fun swimsuit bags. So like bags where you can put wet items in and um, so they don't leak everywhere. And they have some really cool patterns. Um, I just got one in my cause box, so I don't really have a need for one. And I've gotten one in a FabFitFun before, so I'm not going to get them. But they have some really cool tropical patterns and cacti and um, flowers and just some really cute bags. And then summer travel. We're almost done with the add-ons, by the way. And then we'll get to unboxing this box which I'm excited about because guess what I don't remember what I got <laughs> um, so they have some travel bags travel tags um, and then they had some throw blankets so I got one in a blush color for me because I have very natural neutral colors in my room and so I figured like a little bit of blush accent wouldn't hurt and then I'm also getting the same blanket in the slate blue color because my sister's room has dark blues and dark woods in it so I thought that that would look really awesome in her room they have a mint color of the throw as well. And then into the jewelry. So a lot of this I've seen in the add-ons before, so most of it doesn't interest me. I'm not into some of the some of the jewelry styles this month, which is fine. It's not everything has to be for everybody. Though there is a pair of earrings that I am getting, which are these, which are some gold, um, this is gold, like, it's hard to see, but like gold medallion-y things, I don't know. Um, but they're really, really pretty. You might be able to see them better in that picture, but I thought that they're really pretty. As you know, gold is my color of choice for jewelry. They have them in silver, but I believe they're already sold out. Then into some of the silver jewelry, and they have some chapsticks as well. Um, I have so much chapstick. I want it, but I don't need it. <laughs> then they have these really cool, so this is in the sold out section. I'll show you one other thing that I got. Um, I got the, they have these cool like print block towels from India. So I got a set of two of those. So these are the items down here that are already sold out. I'm not gonna go in detail about them, but that's what you can go and see. If, I might be talking about something now that when you go in tomorrow, if you don't have access till tomorrow, um, it may be gone then. So hopefully not. But um, those are some of the sold out things. You can keep an eye on them as well. Because sometimes, like I said, people will drop items out of their basket. Then, so this is the regular add-ons, which I believe goes through the 10th. And then from the 12th to the 18th, I think is the VIP sale, which is similar to the add-ons where you get to add on items and you can use your add-on credits for it. Um, but I think that... Um, 
I don't know if they're older items or what makes them be in the VIP sale. I'm not totally sure, but I like to shop the VIP sale as well. So I'm going to shut this laptop because we've gone through the add-ons. Does anybody have any questions about the add-ons? Let me know in the comments. I'm actually paying attention now. <laughs> um, and then we'll go into this box. This planter, by the way, the hedgehog I got from Globin. This plant I got from Ikea, um, which is probably, these artisans were paid well, these were not. So that's the unfortunate part of that. But now I have this big box and it's actually kind of heavy. So this is my VIP sale items that I got for the month. Um, and I don't really remember what I got. So usually the VIP items and the regular box items ship separately. Um, I get a lot of boxes every month, so I'm used to getting many packages, but let's go through here. So, oh, and I need to get a pair of scissors. I have this pair right here. Perfect. So the first thing that I am pulling out is from Matterboomy. Oh, okay. So this, oh, it has little bells on it. That's fun. I didn't realize is one of these little, I think they're like chickens. I don't know. One of these little garland things that you can kind of just hang. Um, and these, um, okay. The reason why I wanted this and my sister's probably going to kill me because she's like, you don't need that. Um, there was a movie, Die Wilden Hühner, which I used to watch a lot as a child. It was one of my favorite movies. It's a German movie because I grew up watching German stuff. Um, I learned German before I learned English, but they had one of the girls had like one of these in her room. And like, I just always wanted one because of that movie. So now I own one and it jingles. So I don't know where I'm going to put this yet, but I'll find a very special spot for it. And hopefully my sister won't kill me too much for it. All right. So they give you a card about like shopping in Globin, which is awesome as well. And then we have some more items. Oh, one of the earrings fell off. So I got some, another pair of earrings in the VIP sale. These are what they look like. They are gold and they have this like kind of knotted effect. They're made in India. I thought they, they were really cool and unique. I haven't seen a lot of earrings like that. So I'm very excited about those. They have some really cool jewelry that you can get through Globin. Oh, and then I got Pad Thai rice noodles. I can't remember why I got this, but I was probably hungry <laughs> and wanted more noodles. I have so much like pasta and rice right now that I need to um, use up, so. There are the rice noodles. And then, and by the way, if I stand up and you see my pajama pants, it's because I'm wearing pajama pants. <laughs> it's Sunday. Okay, next item is in a box. Now, normally I try to unbox everything. Like in my regular videos, I've usually taken everything for the add-ons um, out of the box because otherwise the videos would be really, really long. So, what did I get? Oh, this is a frame. Okay. Now I remember. It's amazing how you forget what you what you order. So I got this frame here again from Matter Boomy. I really like their products. I tend to get, get a lot of them in the add-ons. I thought that this was a really cool thing. I love the little handle. Um, I don't know if I have a picture for this yet or not, but I thought that this would look really cool on a wall somewhere. I'm trying to. I have one of the Instax cameras, but I think that this is too big for because I have a mini one. Um, but that is what it looks like. Then. Oh, this is a robe. Sorry, I just got really excited. I like don't remember what I ordered at all. So this is very exciting. It's like Christmas all over again. I think it's a bathrobe, I think, but it's in this blue color. Let me figure it out. Okay, so that's kind of what it looks like. I'll put it on. It's not gonna go with what I'm wearing right now. Oh, it has pockets. It's very kimono-esque. It's very like the arms are big and I'm tiny. So, so this is going to swallow me a lot. Oh, this is going to be so comfy. I love taking baths. If you know, I do like, like the bath bomb unboxings and stuff. So, and it has pockets. Oh, what's in the pocket? Oh, it does have a, a thing that's in the pocket. Oh, this is fun. I mean, I'm going to look like way older than my actual age wearing this, but it's really fun. Okay. But let me take it off for now. Cause it's kind of hot here. Um, it's very hot in Virginia. So right now I've been dying the past couple days. That did not sound good, so I'm gonna ignore that for a second. And get this blanket out. So this is a throw blanket. Like I've been saying, I have um, been wanting to put more like pink in my room, like a light color pink. And this, oh wow, this is really cool. 
that has tassels. Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe I'm, I might drop that pink other, that other pink blanket that I got because this is, oh my gosh, because I don't need a million pink blankets, but this is so cool with like the like naturally type of colors. Like this is kind of the color of my room, but I wanted to add a little bit of pink in. And this is a really cool, oh, it's comfy too. Ooh, I, lo I love that. That's really, really awesome. And like this was handmade. That's just crazy. <coughs> Excuse me, some of the like dust particles are getting into my lungs. That's fun. All right, let's figure out. Oh, okay. I know what this is. So this is a wooden vase. So I, there's a set of three of these. <coughs> Woo, really getting in my lungs. Um, a set of three of these and well, there was an add-ons a few months ago where I was able to get the medium and the small, but the large had sold out. Well, they had the large again. So I wanted to get the large to go with the um, with the rest of them. Um, and yes, Caroline, I'm going to be doing a new apartment flat tour soon once I get it all organized. Wow. <coughs> I probably should have brought water over here or tea or something and I didn't. And now I just want to cough. So I'm trying not to. Um, so a couple more things in here, a couple more boxes. Oh, cool. Okay. So I was wanting to get some jewelry organization items. And this is a little piece hand sign where you can put rings on it and then <coughs> I really can't stop coughing um some other rings or other jewelry down there so maybe some earrings I thought it was kind of cool because I have another jewelry holder in this wood a wood tint that is not a word um but you know what I'm trying to say okay cool another box here oh I think I got this for my sister she really liked blue. Did I get this for her? I think I did. And so it is a beautiful wooden box and then the top has this blue. I think I got her one that just had white on it and so it's just a little trinket box and it has that beautiful blue. Um, I guess it's stone but it's really really cool. Excited about that. I'm like running out of places to put stuff so I'm just putting it on the floor for now. <laughs> Cleaning this up is going to be a lot of fun. All right two more little boxes in here. Oh, okay. I have to put this together. So this is a jewelry stand and I got this for my sister because she really wanted a jewelry stand. So this does come apart. I think that this, well, let me figure out what I'm doing first. This. So this goes in here. Look at me being smart. All right. So I'm building the jewelry stand for my sister. I've been building lots of furniture since I moved. So it goes like this. And then there's also a bottom portion that this goes into as well. Um, let's see if I did it right. Yeah. So it is a jewelry stand. I have one like this in the same wood, but it's a different color, which is why I wanted to get the little hand sign. But on the top, it has little holes here where you can stick um, your earrings inside and then you can put other little jewelry items there but this one's for my sister I have one as well too mine is round it's not as tall um, and I just unpacked it today so I still have to put stuff on it and then the last item I think is another one of these hand figures if I remember correctly if you can see in the back I have the picnic basket back there that we got in the June box all right So it is another hand. This one's doing that. So I just have two little hands and they kind of go together and I can just, oops, this one's kind of coming loose, I guess. I don't know. Um, but they kind of go together and you can kind of put them up. So that's some of the VIP um, sale items. So those were my VIP add-ons. Um, you can still shop add-ons, I think through the 10th. Again, if you're like a regular subscriber, it will go, um, my brain <laughs> you'll be able to shop through the 10th and they'll be going live tonight at midnight for you if you're a six or 12 month subscriber they are um, out there now so I'll probably head off here in a few minutes but just wanted to say hi to everybody I'm looking at everybody in the comments um, and I'm really excited to organize my jewelry right now so that's probably what I'm gonna go do what is everybody else's plans for the rest of Sunday I'm curious to, to know are you enjoying your Sunday it is a July 4th week, which is why I picked this shirt. It's red and blue. Um, oh, work. That's not fun. Sorry to hear that. That'll be me tomorrow. 
eaten every other day this week except for Thursday because it's the 4th of July. Um, Kim, it's storming here too, or at least it was for a, a while ago. I don't have a window in this area, so I can't really see right now. Hanging at home with the family, nice. Cleaning, me too, I've been cleaning all day and <laughs> really need to keep cleaning, but my motivation is <laughs> I've already cooked dinner for the week, like meal prep for the week, and so um, at least I got that done. Going out of town, oh, lucky, I wish I was. Reading, movie night. So last night, um, my sister and I were bored and we're like, let's go to the movie because I have some free movie tickets. And we're like, let's go see Aladdin. And it was on in 20 minutes. So we're like, get out the door, like scrambling out the door to go to the movie. And we're like on the way driving there and there's a Target right next to the movie theater. And we're like, do we just want to go to Target instead? And so we did, we just went to Target and shopped instead of going to the movie. Um, getting ready for the week, yes, nice. Supposed to be cleaning the house and grocery shopping. <laughs> well, I'm glad that I could distract you from the things that you need to do. <laughs> I did my grocery shopping yesterday and um, spent more than I meant to, but you know, I bought 4th of July Twinkies, which I don't even like Twinkies, so I don't know why I bought them, but it was just one of those days where that ended up in the cart and somehow I didn't edit it out by the time I got to the checkout. So that's what I'll be eating this week. <laughs> All right, well, thank you everybody for joining my live stream. It has been really fun, a little bit nerve wracking for me because this is my first time doing it. Um, let me know if you want me to do these in the future. I'll definitely be open to it. And now I have to figure out how to turn it off because I don't know how, so I don't know. Now I feel really stupid because I don't know how. I'm guessing I just hit the X in the corner, so. All right, well, I'll see you guys in my next live video or my next video. I don't have any boxes, extra boxes to film right now, so I don't know if there'll be a video tomorrow or not. I'm actually caught up for once in my life, so um, if I get some in my P.O. box on the way home from work, then I'll have a video up tomorrow. If not, you'll hopefully see something on Tuesday.